what is going on guys and welcome to another merge arena video and today i'm going to be breaking down some things that i was thinking about the game and something that developers should definitely keep in mind for pushing this game forward into other steps and also for this game to actually be able to grow into bigger audiences the first thing i'm going to be breaking down is that there is a lot of bots in this game it's been a big concern for a lot of players especially the ones that have really high trophies they are playing against a lot of bots and that is based on the game not having enough players and i completely understand that this is a newer game but that should definitely be improved a lot better or at least just make stronger bots if there's just not that many players playing the game because the game is still quite new then they should just make very strong bots that people shouldn't be able to tell that they are bots that should definitely be kept in mind i think it would be a really nice option another thing is the currency in the game it's very difficult to get currency i know they have a lot of challenges for you to get gold but it's just not enough when it comes to actually progressing your account that becomes a really big pay to win game and that becomes a big problem when you have a lot of players especially younger players who don't have a lot of money to be spending on a video game especially on a phone that is something that definitely needs to be fixed and there should be a lot more rewards for players to be able to grind another thing is i did some summons that i will be posting in this video it's so difficult to get a legendary unit especially a new unit that is something that definitely needs to be changed they keep pumping out legendaries which is absolutely fantastic for the game but they're just so difficult to get that it makes it hard for people to actually enjoy these legendaries there should be legendary challenges at least once a month if you don't want to post every single legendary up for free i completely understand that but there should be at least one legendary per month that you're able to grind through challenges and you should be able to get for those loyal players that you have that loyal player base they should be able to get rewarded with a character like a legendary which is something people are always super excited super happy to get and that is something a lot of games tend to do they are very difficult to get in other games but games like brawl stars do it very nicely where you can unlock it through progression for free it does take a long time but if you do want to pay for it you can upgrade and get it instantly which is something very nice you have something for the free to play player and you have something for players that like to spend money on games so it's going to be a very nice thing if they end up doing this i don't know if they will but it would be very nice for players to be able to play for free and get all these legendary cards by playing through different challenges and stuff and getting points and that can be progression for the game which is going to help the game in the long run it's something that brawl stars is very celebrated for it's because it's very nice as a free-to-play player in brawl stars it was very nice but when i did decide to start spending money on that game it was because i actually wanted to because if i wanted to grind out the characters i could eventually get them but if you want to pay for them you definitely could and these are the types of options typical games that are very successful end up having because free players are the majority of your game and those are the players you kind of have to cater to and then at the same time you make the paid players a lot happier because they're getting a lot of rewards but the drop rates for legendaries are just absolutely abysmal you have to spend so much money and gems are so hard to come by in this game for free as a free to play player you are almost never going to get a legendary you might spend months and not even get a single one and the drop rates are just not good enough and if you're spending 500 gems which is already expensive for you to be able to summon you're also not getting a lot of cards for that money you're getting five units which honestly isn't much especially if you have a high rank account with a lot of trophies which you're facing much better players every time you are summoning getting five cards is just not enough that should definitely be buffed to at least 10 cards because 500 gems is so much for you guys to spend on 10 summons you should be able to get at least 10 cards in my opinion definitely let me know in the comment section below if you guys would like to see these changes in the game so we can let the developers know what they need to do i think these are very important changes for the game's longevity and for a lot of people to have a lot more fun in this game and unlock their favorite characters without spending an arm and a leg because let's face it a lot of people cannot spend money on games and they just don't have the resources to be able to play their favorite cards this is all for the benefit of the game i hope you guys enjoyed the video i like it much appreciate it leave a comment down below and let me know what changes you guys would like to see in merge arena hopefully you guys did enjoy i will see you guys in the next one thank you so much for watching